Hi, I'm nutritionist Dr. Mike Crusell. Now, if you're trying to eat healthy and lose weight, sometimes there could be food choices that really confuse you. Should you eat beef or chicken? Is it flax seeds or chia seeds? Can you take a fish oil supplement or do you need to eat fish? Is plant-based milk just as good as regular milk? What do you, how do you make these food choices? Now, I created the Food Face-Off series to eliminate the confusion and let you know exactly what food you should pick to help reach your goals. Now, if you haven't already, subscribe to this channel so you can get updates and notifications whenever I release a new nutrition video. Next up, whole eggs versus egg whites. This is another classic, classic food battle, right? Do you eat the whole egg or do you eat the egg whites? So the difference here is gonna be the yolk. So if you have an egg white, one large egg white is gonna give you about three grams of protein, right? One whole egg is gonna give you about six grams of protein. So that yolk is bringing in three more grams of protein. And now an egg for the longest time was the gold standard of protein. From a bioavailability standpoint, that's really what we benchmarked everything against. It was the egg because it was so perfect. But also with that yolk, we get fat. So you get about six grams of fat coming along with those three grams of protein in the yolk. So now when you think about, you know, if you've listened to shows before, you're like, well, we need to get 30 grams of protein at every meal. So that's a lot of eggs, especially if you're trying to get it from yolks because the fat's gonna add up. Now that yolk though, it brings a lot of things. Yes, it brings cholesterol, which is what gave eggs its bad rap for a long time. But what we now understand from additional nutrition research studies is that the cholesterol that we consume is not directly reflected in cholesterol levels in our blood. That being said, I don't think you should go crazy and eat six to eight eggs every day right? Because cholesterol still does play a role in overall health and moderate consumption, I think is recommended. However, that yolk does bring vitamin A, it brings some vitamin D, two key fat soluble vitamins, and it also brings carotenoids. That's pro-vitamin A, things that help with eye health, skin health, and immune function. So what I generally like to do is mix egg yolks and egg whites. So for example, my go-to breakfast for a long time now is two pieces of Dave's Killer Bread, toasted. I do three lightly over easy eggs, so the yolk is still a little bit runny. Salt and pepper, uh, I actually like to use Carving House, my friend Casey's uh, seasoning company, Tax of Calories, that's Carving House seasoning is great. Everything bagel seasoning from Trader Joe's, also phenomenal here. But then I'll also do a portion, half to a cup of egg whites that'll also scramble. So what I do is I get all those great nutrients from the whole eggs that the yolk brings along, but then I also do some egg whites to bring my overall protein intake up without bringing the fat intake up as well because I like to cook my eggs in a little bit of olive oil. So a mixture is always best. Now you can separate your eggs. So sometimes what we'll do is during the week, we'll save it. I'm going to do egg whites. I'll save the yolks so we can make ice cream on the weekends because homemade ice cream is so much better than any ice cream you'll buy at the store. But I also will buy pasteurized egg whites. Um, I was put on to pasteurized egg whites by uh, Kyle Fields, who was a trainer that I met back in the day at Peak Performance. He used to drink them out of a, just straight out of the jug because he's a total savage. And they're pasteurized, so it's fine. It's not like eating a raw egg yolk, or excuse me, a raw egg white. But I'll do the can or the ones in the container uh, more often because I feel like it's less wasteful. And if I were to save all the yolks, there's no way I'm gonna make that much ice cream. And if I did, it wouldn't be good for my health. Whole eggs are the way to go but egg whites are also great to bump up your protein intake if you need to control total fat.